Hi, my name's John Storms, and I'm going to give you a tour of my uh, newest, most favorite toy. So this is a little device. It is made by a company called Global Cash, and it is called the iTac IP2IR. Essentially what this does is this will allow you to send IR signals over Ethernet from your computer to this little box over hardwired Ethernet, and there's a wireless version too. And it will then transmit it out to a little IR dongle emitter that sits off of one of these three ports. Okay, so tour-wise, this port here obviously is uh, Cat5 Ethernet, uh, Ethernet for Cat5, has transmit, receive, and connection lights. This is a 12-volt um, AC connection that uh, the AC adapter came with the unit. Above it is a green power, power LED. Then we have this little pinhole here, and that pinhole uh, houses an IR detector, and you can use it with the iLearn utility that you can download online to actually learn the, uh, the remote signals. Um, the Ethernet port is considered to be Module 0, and then this red thing is Module 1. And module 1 here has three ports. Uh, port 1, 2, and 3. And these you can plug in IR emitters. And the, or the intent of this is to control like uh, racks of media equipment, VCRs and DVD players and so on. Um, the third one is special in that you can hook up an IR blaster which has a little bit better range. And that's the one that I use to control the lights. And it is that simple. Uh, great little product. It comes with an API, and what I've done is I've used a uh, Perl to write myself a little library so that I can open up a uh, TCP connection on port 4998 and talk to the device and send it to whatever commands I want. So it has a built-in API, um, and when you do the learn, it'll actually give you the API command that you transmit, and it's very easy. You just put the command in plain text into uh, the socket. Now, if you don't want to program, it does come with some utilities that you can download. Like I said, there's iLearn, there's iTest, and then uh, there's also the utility that will let you play it back. <clears throat> so, very, very nice. You can also telnet into the device on port 4998 and issue the commands directly as well. So, very nice device, device very automatable. Like I said, it also comes in a wireless version and uh, they have a few other products as well. Uh, I use this to uh, program my glow with the show lights and currently I have a simple script that just takes very simple timings from Audacity. After each timing I tell it what color I want it to be and it just simply plays it back. Uh, very nice, very robust. Again, it's a small tool. Here's the label. The label just gives, tells you it's iTech Ethernet with uh, the MAC address. And that's it. That is the Global Cache iTech IP2IR.